Hey there guys, Fave here, and today we're gonna take it back. And we're gonna take it way back to my very first alternate account. So as you guys know, I've been on Roblox a really long time. 2007, April 18, 2007 to be precise. But I made my first second account in May 2007. And the reason why y'all even know about this account is because in the story of Fave, I mentioned this account briefly, and y'all have asked me about it and so, in my server, there's a hashtag suggestions for fave channel, discord.gg slash fave, and Blocky here said, make a vid about your old alt account named Blue Guy. And I'm like, okay. And so that's what we're going to talk about today. But before we could talk about that, let's talk about today's challenge. Today's challenge is, if you've ever left a Roblox game before, smash that like button. And also, subscribe and hit that bell and you'll be blessed forever. Okay, so let's talk about Blue Guy. Well, number one, if Blue Guy is my alt, how come I can't log into him? Well, we have to start from the beginning. It is May 2007, and I am a new Roblox scene. In fact, everything is new to me. I don't know what's going on, and I'm just kind of lost in the sauce. Precisely on May 12th, 2007, I created an alternate account called Blue Guy. Now, the crazy thing is, when you join a Roblox game that is like a default Roblox game and you chat, next to your name you'll have a chat color, like your name will be in a certain color and that will be your chat color. This color also correlates with the color of your nudity swimsuit thing when um, you were not wearing anything on Roblox. And so this is a completely randomized process that nobody truly understands to this day. But Blue Guy's name color was actually blue, and I thought that was the coolest thing ever, okay? And so... On May 12, 2007, I made Blue Guy, and I went back on my other account, 6 Kenny 6 which is now known as Fave with two A's, and I messaged him, Hi, well, welcome Roblox, this is fun, I know, talking like Builderman, how are you? I know I am here since two months, well be safe so you can get friends, no safe, no friends, so be safe, if you'd never be safe, you're never going to get it, okay, be safe! So this is six-year-old Fave rambling his head off, and I'm gonna try to decipher this six-year-old Fave's message. Okay, so first of all, I know, talking like Builderman. This is a reference to the fact that Builderman would message every user when they joined Roblox back in the day. So, I'm like, welcome to Roblox. <laughs> I know, I'm talking like Builderman, so it makes sense. Then, we have six-year-old Fave lying. I said, I know, I am here since two months. But I haven't even been on Roblox for one month yet, and I'm here flexing that I've been here for two months. Look at me lying about my join date in 2007. That's crazy. Anyway, so I guess I'm really big about safety and I want Blue Guy to make friends. It's kind of weird because I'm really just messaging myself this, like I'm, this is a different person. But whatever, it is what it is, right? Now, as you guys already know, every user on Roblox has a user ID. And back in the day, we used to memorize our user IDs. And Blue Guy is an ID I've always had memorized. Like me, I'm 20963. Blue Guy is 24612. One of my friends is 6312538. This is back in the day. Fave is 6979136. And the classic Fedora is 1029025. That's an item ID, not a user ID. Now, why do I have all these random IDs memorized? I don't know. Back in the day, we had nothing else to do than just memorize IDs. Nowadays, IDs are way too long to memorize like back in the day. But it is what it is, right? I mean, Roblox is one. Shiletsky is 261, Builderman is 156, I can do this all day, John Doe 2, Jane Doe 3, but anyway, we're talking about Blue Guy today. So, I had access to the account Blue Guy from 2007 to about 2010, and if we look at his badges here, we can see that he met Fave. So, what is this You Met Fave badge? Well, this is not from 2016, this is a glitch date, but if you look at the image here on this badge, you can see this old fave outfit, and you can see me with my three face with my tuxedo. I'm pretty sure this is my Obama outfit from Halloween 2010, because yes, that is what I dressed up as for Halloween in real life and on Roblox. Obama! Okay, so over here, this is the game. Um, it's definitely changed since whenever the badge was made, but I guess um, this is my haters gonna hate thing, and if you favorited all three games, it spelled out haters gonna hate, and it has 692 faves, so pretty cool. I was all about the faves back on fave, obviously. So what happened to my account blue guy, and why can't I log into it anymore? Well, it's actually pretty simple. I used this account from 2007 to 2010, and I used to have this group in the day called It's a 1337 group. This is the first group I ever made. Bomzo was my friend back in the day, and 
All of most of these accounts are my alts back then. The forum post, I miss 2007, and of course we have Blue Guy. Now you can see the ranks here, and Six Kenny Six has his own rank, but I'm not in the group anymore. And these are some of my other alts. Not all of these are my alts. Some of them are random accounts. But back in the day, people would just make random accounts when they got bored. And if we look at Blue Guy's um, stuff some more, unfortunately, Blue Guy has a private inventory, so we can't investigate his inventory. But he has a Got Milk visor, which is worth a few thousand Robux. Not bad. And if we look at who Blue Guy is following, some random people from back in the day. Now let's look at um, what I was saying on the forums back then as Blue Guy. So on December 26, 2007, Blue Guy said the beautiful words, Golf is my favorite sport. I guess when I was six years old, I was like an old man already. Then I said, I am a very old member of Roblox. Heh, I am very old. The funny part about this thread is I posted this on August 19th, 2008, and... I was only a year old at this point. To think that being a year old on Roblox thought I was very old. But anyway, Ublik replies, I'm close to that. And I said, older. Oh, I replied it over a year later saying older. And then this 2006 account replied, looks at join date. Mwahaha. And then this guy says, too bad nobody cares. And then I replied to my own thread. <laughs> As fave, I beat you. I beat myself? What? What is this? George replies, who bumped it? Sniper Boy replies, I am not that old. The bumper is the creator of this thread, also known as you, Fave. What is with me trying to pretend like I'm two different people? I'm just out here trying to like finesse and trick people into thinking that like these are two different people when really I was blue guy the whole time. Wow, an 11 year old mystery solved. I'm older. I'm not nearly that old. He bumped his thread XD. We really don't care. Well, people weren't very nice to me in 2009, which is pretty sad to see, but it is what it is, right? So we look at these posts some more, and, and so I made a thread in 2010 called Post Here 04 to 07ers, and so nobody posted here, so I guess nobody cared about their join date at this point. And unfortunately, in 2010, the, the password to this account was guessed by some random person. Now, I don't know what had happened here, but unfortunately, I lost access to the account Blue Guy at some point in 2010, and I never got it back. So, I invited a bunch of people out of the inviter badge, and I haven't had access to this account in 10 years. So this outfit right here, not my outfit. This description, not my description. These posts, not my posts. It's creating admin scripts for anyone. I wonder if he was scamming people. And so, he was using this account in March 2011 to post whatever it is. And yeah, I don't know. And so let's see the last time this blue guy logged on. Well, blue guy hasn't logged on in 13 years, which is not actually accurate. The thing about blue the online dates is that if you haven't logged on in a really long time, sometimes it glitches and resets to when you joined. So we don't know the last time blue guy logged on, but we can assume it's somewhere around 2011, considering they've gotten no new hats since then. And oh, he has a little fluffy cloud. Look at the little fluffy cloud. I own it too. I'll fave it. Why not? And yeah, so that's the story of Blue Guy. I know, pretty sad, anticlimactic, but you guys wanted to know about Blue Guy, so I told y'all about Blue Guy, okay? So thanks for watching the video. Let me know what you think down below. Make sure you smash that like button, follow me on Trollux Fave, follow me on Instagram at Fave here. Join my Discord server, discord.gg slash Fave. We do giveaways of people that are active. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much all I got to talk about today. Check out the merch down below, Drippy Collection out now. And it's your boy, Fave, and I am out!